Welcome to the Solid Game University channel. This video's topic is right angle head machining. So to program a right angle head or a 90 degree head machine inside SolidCam, we have to treat it as if it's a fourth axis program. Uh, all that means is that we're gonna set up a sub position under our Mac one position one. So you see that here, I have Mac one position one, I've gone to my corner system manager and I set up a Mac one position two. Really all this is for is just to tell SolidCam that I'd like the tool to approach the piece from let's say perpendicular to this face. So my z-axis just needs to be oriented so it's perpendicular to this face. With a regular fourth axis machine, it would basically rotate it 90 degrees in either A or B or C to achieve that. For this right angle head, it's really just for internal to solid cam for it to understand that it's at 90 degrees to whatever I set up as my, my, um, my setup axis, my Mac one position one. So that's essentially just what that is right there. Um, so, uh, that sets up a subposition to orient the tool within the simulation of SolidCam. But on the machine side, we still need to post out the code to a right angle machine. Um, now, we just want this to be set up as a right angle machine, and that's all basically controlled by the post. Uh, what I mean by that is if we go to the coordinate, to the operation manager, we'll see that under sub machine, I have RAH. Uh, this post was created so that it has a submachine called RAH, so it posts out code specific to the right angle setup, the right angle head setup of this machine. So subposition to set up the tool, and then when we go to post it out, we have it set to a submachine. Um, now, this type of machining inside SolidCam is actually more dependent on the post than usual. As we just saw, the submachine allows us to post out to the right angle head, and my creation of my subpositions also needs to be specific to the machine. You'll notice that Mac 1 position 1 and Mac 1 position 2, they have the same y-axis. For this particular post, for this particular machine, the y-axis y needed to be aligned. Um, for another machine, the y-axis might need to be aligned. Uh, so it's either X or Y. Check with the, uh, the post member, the post key member that, you're, that you got the post from to see which is the best way to set this up. Uh, but other than those three things, everything else programs the exact same way. I have a helical profile toolpath to do that first hole and I have a drilling tool path for all those holes there. If I post out this code, again, just the same as always, click generate, and we'll see that it essentially still falls under whatever my, my coordinate system was, in this case, 154P2, um, and the angle is just A0. So it didn't shift it around 90 degrees, it understands that this is supposed to be a right angle head, but everything else here is the same for the code. Now, what you might also need to check, specific to your machine once again, is if you're gonna do any kind of drilling cycles, you might need to actually turn off the drill cycle. Uncheck that box. Again, check with your post member just to see if you could use the cycles with your machine on a right angle head or if you need to output the code line by line without a cycle. Any questions on this or anything else from Solid Game, you can always call us at 1 866 975 1115, extension 2. You can send us your parts or your questions via the ticket system at solidcamsupport.com or stay tuned for the rest of the videos on the YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.